when might you actually have a product to take to market from this deal? Sure. So as you mentioned, these assets are all relatively early stage. So we would expect in sort of the 20, 30 plus timeframe um, is when we'll actually be able to bring these products to market. But I think what's really exciting about the portfolio that we acquire with the acquisition of Carmont is you're right, we get these three early stage assets, but there are a lot of other um, uh, sort of earlier research assets that are included in the Carmont portfolio. And all of these have applicability, not just as a monotherapy solution, but also in combination with other therapies um, that could again, potentially really change the game when you look at patient outcomes. But just um, keeping on these three experimental drugs, which I know that the, the market has been quite focused on these three, one of them is an oral obesity treatment. And I think the investment community remains divided as to whether an oral version of these GLP-1 drugs can actually work. Just last week, Pfizer, one of your competitors, mm-hmm. had to discontinue their trial of an oral version because it just uh, it wasn't panning out. They had very high rates of adverse side effects. So what gives you the confidence that this oral version can work? So I think we would, we would expect the sub-Q formulations of these drugs, which are the, the current mechanism by which they're administered, to continue to be really important in the delivery of these diseases. And I think that's sort of why we are really um, excited about the Carmont portfolio, because it gives us a breadth of different options. Um, I suspect that we will figure oral formulations out. Um, and you know, the, the, the product that we're acquiring in 996, I think has some interesting initial data to it. Um, but I think clearly there will, be, there, there will be things that we'll have to answer as we go through the development cycle. But I, I do think we will figure out how to deliver these drugs orally. It's just a matter of time.